My family's ordeal with Prevent has been a very stressful one. I don't think you can fully appreciate how much of a mental toll Prevent harassment can have until you are actually faced with it. I generally consider myself to be a strong person, but even I felt broken by this experience, purely because they brought my child into it. This was deliberate on their part, they knew exactly what they were doing. My first interaction with Prevent was when Prevent officers came to my home, asking to speak with my husband. They then decided to use my child as a way to harass us, by claiming that my five-year-old child made a concerning comment at school, and thus again they would like to speak to my husband, and of course they brought along a social worker this time. They would not give us any details as to what the comment was, when it took place, and what this would now mean for our child. The bigoted, anti-Islamic and discriminatory nature of Prevent has compelled ordinary people to think suspiciously of Muslims, and hence, a comment made by my child, which was not actually concerning in the slightest, was flagged up as the opposite, purely because we are Muslims. Prevent has made us feel like we are criminals simply for being Muslim. I find it hard to put into words the level of disrespect, betrayal and insult that I feel from the police, school and social services. None of these agencies had our best interests at heart. My trust with all these institutions has been broken. Prevent Watch have supported us from the very beginning and continue to support us with free help from solicitors and in knowing what our rights and options are. Without them, we would be completely lost.